You are unique. From nothing, the heavens were made, the earth was formed, the oceans were spoken into place, and in His likeness we were created. He, our God, the ultimate creator, you were created uniquely in Him. To be unique is to be the only one of its kind, to be unlike anything else. Each of our reflections beautifully mirroring our creator. Made in His image, we are created to create. Creativity far-reaching like the branches of a tree, varying in shape, differing in form, and producing in fruit. Strengthening and growing with nourishment dependent on the sun, we are all created. But what we create, whether a sermon or a song, is incomplete on its own. There's something missing. But I can't do what he can do. She's better than me. I'm unqualified. I don't have what they have. But you, you were created uniquely. And we, together, are created to be in unity. It's not about what we each are in lack of, but it's about what we together are a part of. On our own, we wouldn't amount to much, but we are better together. So since we find ourselves fashioned into all these excellently formed and marvelously functioning parts in Christ's body, let's just go ahead and be what we are made to be without enviously or pridefully comparing ourselves with each other or trying to be something we are. Uniquely, God created each of us, and in unity, God intended us to work together, hand by hand, piece by piece, all coming together to form a bigger picture, a kingdom-driven, people-loving, Christ-centered, grace-filled, and growing picture. Created by the Creator and called to create, you are unique, and we are united in Him.